Uh, my name is Jeff Nesselpat. I'm the Director of Marketing at GT Advanced Technologies. What I'm going to demonstrate for you today is what we call our scratch test. I have in my hand my company issued iPhone 5 and on this phone I've actually placed a very uh, thin, a half a millimeter thin piece of sapphire as a protective cover screen just to be able to do this type of demonstration. So we call this the scratch test. I'm going to take a, a, a composite material, it's a rock, maybe concrete, I'm not sure exactly what it is, that I found on my way into the venue here the other day. And I want to take this material, I'm, going to, I'm pressing very hard over the surface of the sapphire screen, as you, as you can see. And I don't know if your video is picking it up or not, but what's happening on the surface is I'm actually leaving a trail of dust particles that are being rubbed off this composite material as I'm rubbing it across the surface of the sapphire. And so when I take my cleaning cloth here and wipe that material away, you will notice that there has been no damage to the surface of the sapphire. So sapphire is a material that is extremely hard, extremely durable. It's about three times harder than most of the reinforced glass products that are on the market today. And it's virtually unscratchable. Um, the only material that's harder than sapphire is diamond on the Mohs scale. Sapphire is a, a number nine. Most of the reinforced glass products that um, are on the market today fall into a number seven position on the Mohs scale. So, Sapphire is an extremely durable, extremely strong, very scratch resistant you know, type of material. And we think it's ideal for applications for mobile and touchscreen devices because of those reasons. You know, there's a big problem in the market today with screen breakage on these types of mobile devices. And we think Sapphire offers a superior solution to solve that problem. The cube is actually an idea that came from my wife and uh, and we decided to build it to solve the problem of uh, managing content at home. This